Choctaw Nakoma Park is responsible for educating and inspiring more than 5,600 students like me. Over the last 14 years, the district has made strides to improve its schools. However, there is more work to be done, and some of it requires a voter-approved bond to move forward. I'm not sure if you know this, but school districts across the state only receive funding for daily operations. That means things like new school buses and building renovations require funds from bonds. Therefore, site principals receive input from students, faculty, and parent groups on needs for each school. This information was then analyzed by district administrators, principals, and board members to prioritize needs and evaluate the potential of a bond for our district. They met a whole bunch of times. They took their job very seriously because it's been nearly a decade and a half since the last bond. I wasn't even born yet. The final proposal includes new schools because schools like mine are really full. In fact, some kids aren't even in the main buildings. The classes are in outdoor prefabs. The new bomb will also help me feel more protected with safe rooms, secure entryways, and cameras. You're right. Your safety is our number one priority. The bond also includes money for renovations and updates at nearly every site across our district. There will also be money set aside to build a new multi-purpose indoor facility, new parent pickup lines at several sites, a new BOAG show barn, something special for nearly every program in school. The team listened closely to those in the community who asked some really good questions before adding it to the ballot to be voted on in February. And don't forget, the proposed bond will have no tax increase. So there's the scoop. All that's left to do is vote. If I were old enough, you can bet I'd go vote. For more information, visit our website at cmpschools.org.